Hi guys, this is Mathias, and as I'm sure you remember from the very beginning of the game, there is a gun in Vault 111 that we can't get our hands on, not until we can pick Master Locks. Either way, I decided to go and get it. Now, I'll be honest, it's a little bit tricky to find your way in these vaults. I'll try to uh, show you here the direct way to where this gun is located, so you don't have to run around too much. This is where it starts. You take the right corridor here, and here you take a left, not like I did, I kept going. You make a left here, first uh, left, and then you just keep going right in this, not in here. Just keep following the corridor, which makes a left here. And then you take another left into this reactor room. You just have to cross it, and then it is on the other side of the room, which you get to once you have passed the reactor. Now the fact of the matter is, and I'll show you this uh, in a moment, if you don't have lockpick at master, you can actually come here with Kate and you can get your hands on this gun anyway. I'll show you what it looks like. Hmm. Let me know if you want help with that lock. Oh yeah, can you do it? Hey. Need something? Go check that out. I'm out of bobby pins. Have any on you? Now, when I did this, uh, or when I let Kate do this, she did break at least one bobby pin, so I think if you have two to give her, that's gonna be enough. I just happen hey. to give it ten what at this it? point in time. Go check that out. I'm on it, Captain. This one might be rough. Don't get your hopes up. Shite. Almost had it that time. Got it. Uh -huh. Holy shit, you would come handy for somebody who doesn't have lock picking. Yeah, the things we don't know, I actually didn't bother to check out whether or not uh, Kate could pick locks. See, now Cryolator. Bingo. So your first look at this gun, it doesn't look like much, but once you get out of here and find yourself a workbench, uh, it actually makes a big difference to uh, get some upgrades on this uh, baby. I never liked messing with this technical crap. <laughs> That's gotta be the best scream in the game. So yeah, it isn't all that much uh, that we can do in terms of modding on this weapon, but I decided to replace the three different parts that I could, and it, yeah, it actually makes the gun quite a bit better. Instead of the standard barrel, I go with a crystallizing barrel. And what that does is that it actually adds regular damage to the gun instead of just the cryo damage. That's uh, my interpretation anyway, I hope it didn't get that wrong. The next piece of the gun to replace is the stock. Uh, instead of the standard stock, I decided to replace it with the recoil compensating stock. And I guess the name explains how that improves the weapon. And with the sights, there was only one option to choose from, you know, aside from the standard sights, and I didn't even check that out. It may maybe a little bit sloppy, I could have shown you at least what it looks like. Anyway, there you have it. That's the upgrades or the mods that I put on this weapon. So let's take this baby out for a spin, shall we? Now this weapon is actually fully automatic and I couldn't find a way to change that obviously and I have only put one point into Commando, which is the perk for automatic weapons and that's because I realized early on that I wasn't going to use fully automatic weapons anyway. <laughs> what the fuck is this weapon? Oh shit! What the fuck? A fucking... Oh, a fucking behemoth! <laughs> oh shit, well... Get cryolated! Uh, I don't have much ammo here. Perhaps I have to... I have to soften him off a little bit first. These ones are so fucking weak. Whoa, whoa. You hear that? Oh, that's a brotherhood here. What? Oh, it's a raider. Oh, no, what the you fuck? Don't. <laughs> you know how to show a girl a good time. Now the one thing that I want to mention about this weapon that uh, I didn't realize the first few minutes of using it was that the projectiles that you shoot are very very slow. Aside from that, the accuracy is beyond bad and it has quite a lot of bullet drop. So if you are shooting at a target that is further away than let's say 15 meters, you're basically just gambling. Or maybe you want to consider something more 
up close and personal. Up close and personal though, the bullet drop, the slow projectile speed and the inaccuracy doesn't really matter that much. Instead, this is the typical weapon that uh, makes Fallout into Fallout. And when it comes to weaker targets that I could probably kill with any weapon, I appreciated this, uh, this gun because it was just a lot of fun. But for a lot of the targets that doesn't go down this fast, the cryo damage will at least have a staggering effect. And you can quickly switch to another weapon and finish the opponent off, or you can just keep firing. So yeah, for the rest of the video you'll see me enjoying Fallout 4 with this cryolator, and I'll switch it up with a few other weapons in situations where the cryolator really doesn't do the trick. So yeah, I hope you will enjoy the rest of the video. Thank you all for watching. Radiation, no, 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 no. What an insane weapon. Oh man, please don't be ferals again. Thank okay, you, can hide! Shit. Who is that? Don't leave anything behind that might be useful. Uh, yeah, you you, you can stop that now. There's um, there's something in your way. <laughs> Who's there? Hey. Who's there? It's me. Come and get me. How much you got left? Now this is what I'm talking about. What? Alive. <laughs> Come on, do it, Kate. I was just getting warmed up. What a fucking in, boys. There's nothing out there. Okay, who's oh. first? Wonder if I can. No, it doesn't hit there. Damn. I'm just getting started. Let's not waste bullets. Damn. It's a shame. This is gonna be a piece of cake. <coughs> Don't leave anything behind. Kate admires me. You're not so much against drugs, are you, Kate? I guess that's a good thing for this character. Only a fucking coward hide. No sign of him now. Oh! <laughs> uh, we've. How much can I carry now? I can carry uh, quite a bit. I'm gonna rip your 
the fuck? Hold up. You hear that? Found you. Oh, that must have hurt. Yeah, I think that hurt. Oh! <laughs> 